Okay, so as you can see, it's a great program to use. Welcome back, guys. Like I said, once we ended the episode, great, great, great program. I love using it. So we got up to welcome to this program tutorial and we put the line in. So now we can do some more advanced stuff. So we can ask questions. So if we go echo, where do you want to go? So then we can go here and we can type in um Hold on, guys. I don't know if you can hear this. I'm just... Okay, next time it happens, I'm going to pause recording, answer the call, and um, just see what the hell is going on. Because I hate people just calling me um, in the middle of a bloody call. Okay, guys, so where do you want to go? So for this program tutorial, we can go let let let's go c sixty four c sixty four so that's like a that's a really old program um or um c plus plus. Now, I have two missed calls and a message on my phone. How good is that? Somebody's just trying to call me and piss me off while I'm recording. So I can go C Shark. Okay, so basically, these are just two programs you can use for gaming and uh, coding and stuff. So, now we can go... Hold on, sorry guys. I, I do have to refer back to here. So... Uh, P choice. Ah, I see. So you can really put anything you like. Well, sort of. Um, so maybe you want it to be like ants. So choice. So ah, uh, sorry. Um, A N S. So basically, I could just put set slash P A N S. Wait, did I use? See, sorry guys, I. Do I have to refer back um, a little bit just just to clear my mind on stuff? So I am going to put choice. Um, so whoops, and you definitely need the equal signs. So if that's an if statement, so it's saying that if this person does this, it will do something. So if percent Choice percent equals equals. I don't really know why you need the double equal sign, but it's just, it's there. Um, I think it's the counter of this. So if we go back here, ah, yes, it is. Just just making sure. So if it equals C sixty four, go to C six. Uh, go to uh three if percent choice percent equals 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 c sharp go to or so now we can i i'm wait i have to refer back because i'm not sure how to Okay, you you don't need to close this. So I can just go to say thirty three, maybe thirty five. Now I can go to three, and I can go echo. Wait, no, I'll clear the screen to make it more you know thingied. I guess uh professional. Whoops. Um, 
If you don't have Notepad++, it is a free program to use. I'm going to bring my mic in closer to me, so maybe you can hear me a bit better. Um, it is a free program to use and is absolutely brilliant for programming. If you're just new to programming or you really want to get a kickstart, I suggest you watching the full series or go out and watch a few other videos because they might have a little bit, a few more different things. So I will be covering lots of things like VBS and all this stuff. But for today, we are doing this. So I can go echo. Welcome to the C64 tutorial. So, I might want to program a tutorial in a batch file. So, then I can go echo space like that. Then I can go echo stop. So, the pause is like a, the um, whole stop mark is like a stop. It stops it. So I can go pause. I can go CLS. I can go go to go to five. So now I can go here and go uh, four. So this is for the C sharp tutorial. So if I clear the screen, color F. Whoops. And then I go Echo, welcome to the C sharp tutorial. Dot echo. Whoops. Remember, see, like I said, guys, gotta remember that space. Echo dot pause CLS. Now, this can be a little bit repetitive. Six. So, if we just save this now, and we re-enter it, tutorial, okay, so, now we have, hello user, what is your name, like usual, hello there, user, so, welcome to the program tutorial, now we press any key, so, where do you want to go, so, I'll, t I'll type in C64, now, you have to make sure, you might want to type, like, echo, make sure you type the exact thing, because if you put, like, capital C, 64 this will not load so you really got to make sure you type it in exactly so we press enter welcome to the c64 tutorial and there we go cannot find the file because the file was not created we're not even up to five yet so i hope you guys enjoyed this episode next episode we might continue we might even add a few more commands in so my name has been Draxus. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys later.